we want to show how to make a complete installation of a coalesce induction furnace. At Lafarge Factories we have developed a so-called glass furnace, so we help ourselves to show what you should and what you should not do to avoid different type of problems that can arouse during installation. We fill the bottom of the furnace completely with the air and we level it. After that, we place in the bottom vibrator and run it for five minutes. After the vibration is finished, we remove the segregated grains which could keep on the top of the surface and uh, we scratch the surface area around which will be in contact with the wall. We introduce the former and make sure that it is well centered. We measure on the top and, if possible, in the center and bottom to assure the proper placing. After centering the former, it must be fixed with clamps to avoid movement. We will demonstrate different methods of filling the furnace by using big bags or sacks of 25 kilos. First, we will show the emptying of a big bag by using a filling uh, device. The advantage of this system is that very little dust is produced. Another advantage uh, by using this system is that by eliminating the free fall of the material, less segregation should occur. By filling with bags, we are going to do it in two different ways, a proper way and a wrong way. To illustrate the right and wrong doings of an installation, we will do half of it in a wrong way and half of it in a right way. For a correct installation, after filling the bags, de-airing is necessary. This will also help to reduce segregation after filling. As you can see, in a wrong way, the bags are filled in the same place, no de-airing is done and segregation can be noticed. We have created some areas of very segregated material to show that after vibration they won't improve whatever good equipment you use for installing. We have prepared some windows to demonstrate the need of properly applying the coil grout. On the windows the inner glass has been removed to create an uneven backlining. As you can see, segregation is formed on the bottom of each frame where the window has been modified. Therefore the importance to install properly a coil grout, having a very smooth surface. That shows that even if using very good vibrating equipment, it still remains very important a correct filling method. Now the furnace is ready to introduce the compactor. We place the compactor at the bottom of the furnace as far down as possible and start it up. The machine will automatically adjust to the diameter of the former. The machine will start turning during vibration. And the only thing one has to do is to lift it up little by little. The vibration time will depend on the former diameter and thickness. The compactor developed at Lafarge Refractories is made to suit the needs of all our dry vibratable materials. Some of the main advantages are very easy to use as no tools are required for adjusting the equipment. As the Lafarge Refractories compactor is very small, it is easy to transport and handle. It fits a very wide range of former diameters. Due to the high efficiency of the equipment, a high frequency vibration is constantly maintained. The pistons are expanded pneumatically 
to maintain a constant pressure against the former. The compactor is supplied with installation and service instructions.